Dude. <laughs> Highway, going in. It's just rough. Oh, what? Why are we doing this? <laughs> it always seems to be like that in Urbex. Well, there is actually a fence there. It's true. I did see that. So I think we took the right way. You guys will not believe what's inside this building. Plus, I need your light source for this. You're the light. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, oh, shit. Oh, God shit. damn. So yes, this is an abandoned arcade slash casino graveyard that we're exploring right now. Thousands of arcades and casino machines just left abandoned inside here. So I'm just gonna work my way and explore each row of arcade machines and these all the way down there. It's pretty far. I think a lot of these machines are very different from each other, so they won't be the same. Damn. Dolly Roger. I think these arcade machines are all European, so I don't think a lot of you guys in America will will notice them, unless you've been here in Europe before and did some gambling. Bingo. But yeah, isn't this really cool, guys? If you're enjoying it, leave that thumbs up and leave a comment down below. Let me know. And if you know anyone that would be interested in watching this, do share the video. Is this a Playboy bunny machine? I can just see the bunny ears. Dancing spirit. They cost five cents. All right, so I just borrowed West Light. Appreciate it, man. We're gonna go through this. It's so dark in here. I don't even think I can get some cinematic shots. So this will just be like a regular vlog with very low cinematics. Sorry guys, but I know you guys really just want to see the arcades and the machines, so I think that's a good thing too. We just got done with the first row, and as you saw, they were all different. So that's what I'm really happy about. We're not gonna be seeing the same things over and over again. storm I can't believe that these are all just here in pretty good condition too the scrappers haven't done really much to them which is good this place will be always kept secret I am not letting anyone know this spot So for those of you commenting, where is this, where is this, you're not getting it. That's not urbex at all. We want these places in good condition. King Kong Cash. If any one of you have played on one of these machines, Leave that comment down below and let me know which one that you've played that you've seen so far. And yeah, these are no cutscenes. <laughs> I'm not cutting any of this really. Just to show you guys that 
there's like hundreds or even thousands of these in here. Whew. This is a workout, just holding this camera and just walking and walking, showing you guys. Obstacle blocking our way over here. Oh yeah, I squeezed through though. <laughs> Ooh, almost tripped. <laughs> oh, these were the things I used to keep. These would keep the tokens and sometimes the money, I believe. Just made it to the last row. What is this thing? This could have been another machine too. Looks pretty crazy. I wonder how you would play it. Oh no. Wait a minute. Oh no, that's a sphere. I thought they said winner for a second. I thought this thing would like announce a person who won. Oh, look at this one. This one's just here on its own. Let's see the inner working stuff, arcade machines. And they're thought to be seen inside of like a casino lottery machine. These things were built for people to lose their money. They're not bad too. See like all the wirings are still there too. I like it. If this was in America, it would not be like this at all. Everything here would be probably scrapped up. So I thought these would be arcade machines, but so far I've been seeing a lot of slot machines only. So I do apologize for that. When I first saw the picture online, it really caught my attention. I thought these were like an abandoned arcade, but no. So I guess the building we're in was the casino. I see everything left behind from it, like the chairs. Oh wait, these look like arcade machines. This is definitely from an arcade machine. So I wonder if there's more around the area since we found that. And there might be. Oh nope, there's still lottery machines. Darn. Look at the chairs. It's kind of creepy, huh? A clown face laughing. 
That's kind of weird a picture. Just imagine yourself sitting on one of these chairs gambling and losing your money and this clown is just laughing behind you. Oh, it's a shooting game. I was right, there are some arcade games here. I found two so far. This is the shooting game. Uh, the rifles are not here anymore though. Ooh, we got another Sega arcade machine. Behind this. What? Damn, that's a huge TV. All these boxes had the chairs inside them. Oh, <laughs> it's just a TV stand. I bet. A lot of people watching who collect these unique stuff would love this. This looks like it used to be the office for the casino. Everything's just left like this now. Like, <laughs> oh my god, dude. You scared me, man. It seems like everything was just packed up and ready to be set up. And then all of a sudden, somehow, they just ended it all. This still has bubble wrap all over it. Yep. Dude. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I like how it looks. Yeah, you can get the picture. I'm gonna shine the light for them. There's so many here. Hmm? There's so many slot machines here. Yeah. Okay. So what sounds? A lot of the urbexers have written their name on here. Well, this was recent. Someone came here on January 2018. Divine urbex. <laughs> so many. It's crazy how this community has grown. That's it. We came to a dead end. <laughs> There's one spot that I haven't shown you guys and this is the last spot of the casino that I think is really, really cool. These are parts of the roulette table. And yes, there's one still intact right here. I think this is the best game to win money in a casino. Yeah. Yeah. I've been to a casino, but no? No, I haven't. I've been probably twice or three times. Yeah. But all I do is just play roulette. Oh, really? Friends. Oh, yeah? yeah? I don't even know how to play that. No. We will teach you. <laughs> you should. I know people that like. On a daily, they just play like um, poker to win money yeah. for a living. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just to know about you guys. Leave a comment down below if you've ever gambled before. And also, have you guys ever won a lot of money out of it? I know I haven't. I've, I've probably lost all the time whenever I go to a casino. And that's why I don't even go.
we just found the blackjack table. Guys, thank you so much for making it this far to the end of the video. I hope you guys really did enjoy it. We finally made it to the end of the road trip and it's been a blast. I thought this place was absolutely amazing. You will never find an abandoned arcade place like this ever with just thousands of them laying there. I just want to say a special thank you to the squad I was with, Exploring with Wes, Armani Kulin, especially with Canopsia Wander. She's the one that really planned this trip out and this is why we were able to explore such amazing places. So definitely check out everyone. Their links will be down in the description below. I can't believe I'm finally done ending this series because I'm really excited and stoked to bring you guys some new explorations. After that road trip ended, I've been here in New York City for the past month and a half and a lot of stuff has happened. I've been invited by Sony and they flew me out to California. They gave me a private tour to one of America's oldest theaters in the world. I also explored this crazy abandoned asylum and I explored a couple mansions that I cannot wait to release and show you guys. Right after that, I'm on my way to my next trip, which is gonna be in Europe. Uh, try to guess the countries down below in the comments. So I'm just staying busy, trying to give you guys the best of the best. You already know how we do it. Besides exploration though, I've been doing a lot more here in New York City, meetings, hanging out with friends, exploring. So you guys will see that pretty soon. I'll probably release a video um, updating about my life either tomorrow or the day after tomorrow. So be on the lookout squad. Anyway, I'm ending the video here guys. Thank you so much. If you did enjoy the content, don't forget to subscribe. Hit the bell button to get notified. Leave the thumbs up and I will see you guys on the next adventure. Peace out. Live a life of freedom and wonder.